while I'm here, boys, I just want to remind you that um, I am streaming Castle Clash on my second channel every Thursday and Sunday and every update stream. Link in the description for Angry as a Game at 2.0 and I also do other games on that channel. Enjoy this video. What's going on guys? It is your boy Angry as a Game and I come with a bit of knowledge today for the new balloon event. Um, I'm sure you've seen it on Gaming Arts channel already, but I'm here to throw some figures at you. Um, this new balloon event, I mean, it's pretty nice, okay? Let's face it, we're getting prestige for free. But how much prestige are we getting, and how much is that going to cost us? So I can tell you straight off, all this prestige put together is 54,000 prestige. Um, which isn't a lot. Especially when they say it's the new balloon event, go and sell your precious, precious resources. Yeah, even though it's not much. Even though it's not much, uh, you're still gonna, if you, if you're free to play, I mean, this event would probably help you out with 54, I mean, 54,000 um, prestige. So it might help you out. But as you can see, free to play can get 51,200 at my might level. At Bong's might level, it's 89,000 prestige a day. 51,000 prestige a day. And you can get that like that. Just wait for the right time. Um, I don't know, is it the right time at the moment? No, it's not times two yet. So, yeah. So, is it worth it? I don't know. You gotta decide that for yourself. Is it worth spending your resources to get 54,000 igniting, uh, 54,000 prestige? Okay, let me give you some figures over here. So, if we are gonna look at this balloon event and we're gonna look at the talent ruins, as you can see, it costs three. And that's five. You can do it five times. So that's 15. 15 talent ruins. And that will give you 50, uh, 45,000 uh, prestige for 15 talent ruins. Gold books, you're going to spend 250 to do the complete one. This is the complete one. So uh, when I'm talking about complete. Okay. Um, so 250 gold books for 12,500 prestige. Zenith stone, you're going to spend 100 Zenith stone for 2,500. Because uh, you get 100 per box. 100 prestige per box. You get five boxes, you times that by that. Okay. So, uh, Apex crystals, you're going to spend uh, Apex crystals 50 for 2,500. Capstone rubies, you're going to spend 30 for 3,000. Um, which is quite nice. No, that's not 3,000. Am I kidding? Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is 3,000. Never mind. I just confused myself. Uh, Voidwalker Signet. You're going to spend 50 Voidwalker Signet for uh, 3,000 of those uh, prestige. Um, Autobound Signet. You're going to spend 50 for 3,000. Igniting Stones. You're going to spend 300 Igniting Stones to get a whopping 3,000 prestige. Comic Rock. Five, you're going to spend 10 of them to get 10,000 um, prestige. And Comic Rock 6, you're going to spend 5 to get 10,000. So, total of 54,000. Is it worth it? It is up to you. To me, I'm going to say no. If, if they would have come in and saying, okay, because we can get, if they would give us a week's worth of prestige. That would be nice. Right? Or well, let's say, let's just round it up to 500,000 prestige. You could get, because I mean, 500,000 prestige, you can't do a lot with that. You, you would think you can do a lot with that, but no, you cannot. I'm always out of prestige. I always spend my prestige. So another 54,000 on there is going to look nice because I do, don't, because I don't have a lot. Um, so let's go in here. So let's look. Let's start with the level 10 talent ruin. Go down. Okay, so I've got 66. I need to spend 50 of that. This is my free to play account. Uh, gold books. I have 9,868. I need to spend 250 of those. Um, comic rock. I need to spend 10. I've got 260. I need to spend 5. I need to. I've got 201. So that's okay. I guess that's not too bad. Uh, for the zen. Okay, so we've done that one. Let's go down. Okay, so Zenith, I've got 7,848, which is quite a lot. I need to spend 100 of that. 
capstone, I need to spend 30 of, uh, not the, uh, 30 of the capstone, and the apex crystals, I need to spend 50, which isn't bad, I mean, I can clear that entire board in the first day, and then the balloon event is done for me, um, which is sad, thought it was going to be a lot better than this. For the um, Void Walker, I need to spend 50, and for the um, Autobound Signet, I need to spend 50. So, not too bad, that's all of it. So, all in all, the resources, I do have all of them. Um, I would be able to grab myself... 54,000... 54,000 um, prestige? Is it a good thing? No, I feel like they need to... Um, because Hex Painter is an event only hero, uh, or game mode only hero, they need to put her in there again, like they did last time. Because at this point, they only have her with the higher hero crystals. Um, and free to play don't quite often get that. They do five at a time, but getting her with five is going to be damn near impossible. As you've seen, I did 540. Of those hero crystals on bong's account and i only got one um so <laughs> the odds of getting hex painter for free to play like that is not really good um yeah so yeah for me this event isn't the best one the uh, new balloon event this one coming isn't gonna be the best but i mean it's free anything that's free is good i guess it's not free because we had to work out um, we had to grind the game to get the resources that we currently have, so, yeah. So, let's figure out what can I do to keep you busy for four more minutes. I need to make revenue off of this in any way, so, might as well do that. Um, hmm, what can I do? Oh, I've, uh, done some Lost Realm, and a lot of it, I might say. So, I do have some more stuff in here. Look, I've got a victory horn now. I have a level three uh, bone rot insignia, so uh, yeah, I've been, I've been, I've been coining it there. Level one. I'm not getting um, the rebirth one. Might as well play some uh, of this while we wait for the time to elapse. Let's hope we get the merchandise store early. Done. By the way, uh, if you, I don't know if I've added this in the beginning of the video, but link in the description for Angry as a Gamer 2.0. I do other gameplays there. I've just uploaded a gameplay from um, Into the Pit, which the graphics are horrible on that. Oh, nice. In guidance. The graphics are horrible on that one, but um, it's quite good. It's. Uh, it's low graphic game. It's really low graphics, but the the gameplay is super smooth on that and If I didn't mention this in the beginning of the video, I will be uh, streaming Cause of clash live streams on that channel only from now on so tomorrow night Sunday and Updates and all those types of things will only be streamed on that channel So Make sure to go hit that to hit that what? Okay Hit that subscribe button over on that channel. Help a brother out. I'd appreciate it. Thank you so much. Oh, I was looking at the wrong... No wonder. I was looking at the wrong thing. Not secondary insignia. What am I talking about? I just realized that now. i gotten so much, so many... Um, secondary insignias. And I was looking at... Uh, uh, normal insignias. And I was looking at secondary insignias. Which is crazy. Why did I think Adeptness Insignia? Am I stupid? Yes. You don't have to answer that. I can do that myself. Thank you very much. Get out of here, you midge. Done. Playing rod, nice. Okay. Uh, let me go and have a look at what I have. 
point seeing as now. Because I've gotten quite a few. Okay, look at that. We've got um, Wind Guidance. I can level that up. Um, I've got a couple of these ones. I'm getting Prism. Mm, getting a lot of Blade Dancers. Uh, not many of those. I did get a couple of Flame Guards. Which is nice. Uh, lots of Unholy Packs. Hmm. Oh, look at that, look at all the flame guards, everything. Not the best, but I mean, it works. But that's going to cut it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please remember to leave a like, subscribe, and I will definitely see you guys in the next video. Thank you and goodbye.